Where is your wife? Bring a band. Where is your wife? Your wife. Eh? You're not with that. Eh? Ayupo. Ayupo. You happy? Where is she? Bring a pen. Okay. I know what I'm doing. Sawa Na sifanye kama mimi. Nafikiri utashanga hii kitu ambacho kiongea. Kwa sababu ukutazamia ni taongea. Kabisa. Sawa eh? Eh. Huyu mama this woman. Ni mtu muhimu kwako. Is an important person to you. Yeah. Yeah, ni mtu muhimu. She is an important kwako I don't want to stand. Shika ikalamu. Take this pen. Eh? Mimi lakini nisikilize mimi. Sawa eh? Ulikutana naye wapi? Where do you have an encounter with her? Kwao. Kwao. Mm. Ukapenda. And you love. Mm. Kabisa. Wait, tika. Just respond. Kweli. Jo. Kaka. Jo basi huku. Jo chap chap. Nataka nifanye kazi niliyotumwa kufanya leo. Jo. Ukampenda. You love her. Ndio. Kwa moyo wako wote. Wote. Baka leo. Until today. Hapana. Umpendi tena. Do not love. Kabisa. Kabisa. Totally. Wewe unaweza kufikiri nini kilichokufanya usimpende? What made you? Alifanya nini mpaka unamuona hivi? What did she do exactly? Eh? Yeah? Mm. Wewe unaweza kufikiri ni nini? What you Sio kufikiri. Ah. Hapana. Una ndiko fayade? Ni kitu kiko wazi kabisa. Ni kitu kiko wazi kabisa. Ndio. Okay. Naomba unisikilize vizuri. Listen carefully. Huyu mwanamke ulimpenda? That woman you loved. Na alikupokea kwa moyo wake. And she received wote. with all of her heart. Lakini changamoto kubwa. But the great challenge. Huyu mama. This woman. Kwao hawakuridhia. Ni kweli. Wewe kuwa mume wake au wewe kumoa yeye. Alafu Kwa sababu kidogo ufahamu wenu ulikuwa umefunguka wako wako na yeye mkaona vile wanavyofanya sio kitu ale bredi sisi tumependana as long as we love each other eh? ni kweli deep man of god professor nisikilize basi ndugu yangu kwa sababu mimi yani sasa hivi nimeshaenda mbali sana unaelewa leo mkachukulia kawaida mwaka wa kwanza wa pili wa tatu wa nne mambo yakaanza kubadilika things start to change Unaelewa vizuri? Yeah, ni kweli. Mambo yakaanza ku change. Mambo yakaanza ku change, yakaanza ku promoka. Kadiri mlivyokuwa mnazidi kusonga mbele, unazidi kuona hali ya kukosekana uaminifu. Kabisa. Eh? Kabisa. Lack of trust. Ikafika sehemu ukasema ya nini? Bora ni atana naye. Okay, sikiliza. Bravo. Najua alichofanyiwa. Lakini huyu mwanamke, kwa nini nakupa kalamu? Huyu mwanamke alikuwa na nyota ya kuja kutunza kumbukumbu ya mambo katika maisha yako. To keep the memory onto your life. Sawa hii? Na walio mkataa asiwe mkeo, wao ndio walimfanyia hichi kitu kwa mganga msukuma. Sukuma which doctor? Walimkoroga vizuri sana. Very well. Sasa wewe uka hukumu kutokana na kitu kinachoitwa tokeo lakini nyuma ya tokeo uone mimi nakupa hii kalamu brasa one day utakuja kunikumbuka siku moja you remember kwa sababu ninavyoongea serikali ya Mungu nayo mtumikia kwenye masabau tayari ipo kwenye issue amina nisikilize mimi sina ulazima wote kwa kwenye maisha yako lakini kalamu naomba utunze siku moja utakuja kuniambia mwenyewe Unaelewa sasa? Na kuelewa. Eh, nenda baba. Asante. 